What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Justice Falls. We back at it again with another video. Today we're looking at the Sony PSVR2. Now I'm more of an Oculus kind of guy. Um, I have the Meta Quest. I have the Meta um, Quest Oculus Two. Yeah, I did a couple. I did a review on the first one and the second one. I'll link it somewhere on the page. Um, didn't check out the first VR PlayStation VR. Never got a chance to play it. But this one is has been catching my attention the more they announce about it. So we're going to take a look at another, at this video, then take a look at the website, see what's available, see if you can pre-order or get any, any more information or anything like that. So without further ado, let's get to the video. Okay. I like the controllers. The controllers look dope. Real futuristic looking. The haptics, the haptics are back. That was triggers, of course. The tension you can feel. Feel a real, feel a new real. Okay, what did, did, did that, okay. So PS5 requires, so you can't play it without the PS5. I mean, as I mean, as it should be, because you know, y'all gotta y'all gotta get y'all money up, y'all got y'all gotta get y'all grind up, man. I'm telling you, I have a whole video or a whole section of a video telling you how you could get a PS5 and an Xbox Series X. I got mine within two weeks of of searching. I got both within two weeks of searching, and they both got delivered within within weeks. So, you know, if I could do it, y'all could do it. I'm just a regular guy. I'm not no, you know, special YouTuber or nothing. I don't have no special plugs. I'm not tapped in with all the top guys. And I was able to get one. So, if I was able to get one, you should be able to get one. All right. So, now we're going to check out the website. Um, PlayStation VR. Escape into Worlds. A truly feel. A truly, a truly feel. Let's keep it to worlds that feel truly real as virtual reality gaming takes a huge generation leap forward coming early 2023. So early 2023 to me means uh, February or March because it's not going to come in January. I doubt it's going to come in January. Clicked on updates. When will the P PlayStation VR 2 launch? Register for email updates here and let you know when the launch date is available. When I click that, it just took me back down here. What games in development? More than 20 games are currently in development for PS2, VR2, PlayStation Studios, and third party partners include Resident Evil Village, Walking Dead, Saints and Sinners, Chapter 2, Retribution, No Man's Sky, and PS2 VR exclusive Horizon Call of the Mountain, which we saw in the game. And we saw Resident Evil Village. And we saw um, Firewall, that game called Firewall sh Shooter. Can you pre order? Pre-order information will be available at PlayStation.com, PlayStation involved as soon as it is announced. Register here to be alerted when pre-orders go live. And does PS2 VR work with PlayStation 4? Nope, it only works with PS5. So you gotta gotta get your gotta get your game up. Gotta get your money up. The original PlayStation VR is compatible with PS4 and PS5 consoles by using an adapter available for PS4 owners with no extra costs. Okay, so if you have the original PSVR, it's not 
it's not like junk anymore or relic anymore you can still use it but i think you're going to want to get the ps2 vr because when i saw the ps2 when the, P, the ps vr like it's it's like a separate console that you got to connect and all this a big ass power supply like it doesn't feel portable so i think they took that information and they improved upon it for the second one so um let's see the uh specs the headset is an oled screen okay oled screen um 20 i mean 2000 by 2040 per eye um 900 hertz to 120 hertz 90 hertz 120 hertz that's tough adjustable lens 110 degree view side range of motion like fit like field of view um six sensor six axis motion sensing system a gyroscope and an accelerometer um ir proximity sensor four embedded cameras in the headset vibration it takes type c built-in microphone jack and built in uh a stereo headphone jack so that's dope so you get a 3.5 millimeter uh headphone jack and it has a built-in mic so you don't have to go through hoops to record the audio because i've always wanted to like do like vr with my oculus but it's so much work to get around to do to to record audio like to get chat audio and to get my audio like it's it's not to me it's not worth it so um then you get the controller with all the buttons all the buttons you'd expect on it um uh, compatible you get the haptics and all of that so um this is looking like an improvement upon upon uh, existing technology. I'm, I'm like how I was looking. I want to know what the price is going to be. It's probably going to be more than five hundred. It's probably going to be like seven hundred. How about let me see how much the original PSVR was. PlayStation VR. Okay, the original ones. They had a bundle for two fifty. Bundle for three fifty. Um. These days up. Oh, let me go back because I don't want to show them my thing. But um, yeah. So like three fifty, two fifty. That's what I'm seeing. That's probably how much it was when it dropped. I'm not sure, but um, I'm guessing it'll probably be around five to five to seven hundred dollars. If it's more than seven hundred dollars, I ain't getting it. So we'll see. But um, and then here's all the games that some of the games you can see. That's gonna be on the on the platform. A bunch of trailers there, um, but I don't know. I think it's gonna be dope. I think I, I definitely wanna check it out. I'm definitely gonna buy. I'm definitely gonna to try to do some videos on it and stuff like that. But um, y'all, let me know what y'all think. Do you think this is cool? Are you not into VR? What's the word? So y'all already know the vibes. Like, comment, subscribe, all of that good stuff. This is your boy Justin Falls, and we out one.